you are all listening to <laughs> Drizzy Radio. Drizzy Radio. Yo, what's popping, everybody? It's Gold Drizzy. Welcome back to Drizzy Radio, a place where we talk about celebrity gossip, celebrity news, trending topics, anything. Get a cup of tea. Let's get messy. As I've told you before, my name is Drizzy, mm -hmm. self proclaimed spokesman of Oh Madonna. I will always tell you everything as it is going, okay? So. Many people have DM'd me asking me or oh, Drizzy what's going on with Tanasha Donna and Omale. One thing I can tell you that is they are pretty much together at the same place right now as we speak. They're probably having dinner, you know, laughing at us bloggers, trying to figure out which hotel they're in. Because guess what? Mm -hmm. Yesterday Omale had to change the hotel. He it was booked to him by the organizers of a B Club. Okay. Organizers of B Club had booked an hotel for if you look at Eric Omondi's background, you will see his background looks like where Omale was at first when he first landed. Okay, but right now you will see that Omale has really his background is really changing. We are following them with their background, so his background is really changing. So my sources are telling me that Omale knew that where the organizers had booked the uh, the hotels, you know, Eric Omonde is very, very messy and very, very nosy, of course. He could have wanted to know everything. Plus, there were so many celebrities there and it could have been easy to take the picture of them. So that way, they decided to went to a private place, honey. Mm -mm -mm, girl. And I'm also being told that Tanasha Donna, after performing, went straight to where Omale was, okay? And that's why Jocelyn's background looked like um, DJ DJ Jonel, okay? Omale's DJ. Their background looked alike. I told you all that, you know, I bet they were, you know, making stories while taking those videos, okay? But you all know we are nosy and we are very messy and we smell everything. So we noticed that from the get-go. I'm also being told that Tanasha Donna and Omale are so much in love, yo. They are enjoying themselves by the pool. As you can see that Tanasha Donna lying down, you know, bathing the sun, feeling the sun near her boo. Near, huh? Feeling the boo, you know, they haven't seen each other for a minute. So I'm sure they really, really missed each other. Okay. I personally, I love this couple. Let me tell you why. Okay. Omale is a very, very private person. Okay, Tanashi Donna is a very, very private person. They are both two private people. Even though my sources are telling me that Omale really wants this thing to be known. But you know, Tanashi Donna, she is too humble and she is too private. She doesn't like her stuff being known out there. You remember when she was with the Diamond Platinums, even the Esma, the Yuda, big headed Esma, said that. <laughs> God, did I say big headed? Esma said that Tanasha Donna is not a show off person. She loved to live her private life private. Okay? Because let's face it, if Tanasha Donna was a cloud chaser, she could have easily used this publicity that she's getting to do something like drop a music and start, you know, saying Omale oh, is my boo, you know, posting Omale oh, and stuff. But then she's like, nah, I ain't going to do that. I'm going to live in my truth. That's why I'm telling you all that this thing is real. It's not for publicity. It's not. These people have been together for one year. One year. So that's such a long time to have studied someone. And they're still going strong. Okay, even if it's a long distance relationship, they're still going strong and they love each other. And I love the fact that people are appreciating Omale in Kenya more than before. Ever since Omale started associating with Tanasha Donna, Omale has been benefiting in Kenya. And Tanasha Donna also name has been popping. Okay, let's face it. We can't say it's only been one-sided. People are talking about Tanasha. People are talking about Omale. They're both benefiting from all this publicity. But if Shadala doesn't watch out, Omale is going to take. That is if he doesn't, he hasn't take his spot right here in Kenya. People are starting to love Omale. Do you all see, did you all hear how people were jamming on Omale's song? And that's another video that I will do. How people were jamming on Omale's song. How crowd were loving him. If Diamond doesn't watch out, Omale is going to take his spot. So that's just about it. I thought I will drop here and give you that tea. And 
we are on their trail and i'll be giving you tea as i'm getting them keep it classy stay messy please drag me on the comment section i love you to the moon and back bye bye